year-old child fighting for his life after being shot in the head today. Thank you for joining us. I'm Tracy Cornett. And I'm Marius Payton. Tonight, investigators in Cheatham County are still putting together the pieces, trying to figure out how this happened. Our Sharon Danqua joins us here in studio after speaking to neighbors who watch this commotion and watch the aftermath unfold. I mean, what a sight. Sharon, your child, you're hearing that this child was not home alone? Yeah, deputies say the three-year-old boy was inside his home with his mother when he was shot in the head. Neighbors watched him get rushed away. Just police car after police car started coming. And Natasha Cobb says they were all rushing to this home on Hazel Drive. I was outside in my backyard and I had heard the sirens and heard um, a helicopter coming overhead. She walked out front and her mouth dropped. The Lees were just two houses down gardening when they heard someone had been shot. It was just devastating to find out that it was a child. And we knew when we saw all of the action going on, it had to be something really bad. They watched paramedics rush a three-year-old boy down the street to a field before he was airlifted to Vanderbilt Medical Center. And he had gotten shot in the head. And this was all while deputies say his mother was just feet away. I saw the mother just unconsolable on the front porch just sobbing and um, she had blood on her and you know they're helping trying to help clean her up and stuff and then the father I guess came home shortly thereafter that neighbors say they didn't hear the shot but were devastated for his family it's just hard to imagine what she's going through and, and anything I mean it could happen to anybody they say they're now just praying for that little boy I was just I was heartbroken I you know, like I said I've, I've seen a little guy grow up and as of now, we're hearing the little boy is still alive. Deputies are investigating to find out what exactly happened.